Hey guys, KT here. Welcome back to some more Skyrim. The last time we finally made it to Riverwood after we explored a mine and got some wicked gear. Now we're currently exploring the house because why the hell not? And uh, just, you know, just doing uh, the kindest of deeds. I trust you're not planning any trouble. What? Uh, by, you know, you talking to people. Did you really not? see a dragon? Yes, I did. Uh... Oh, there you go. Right. <laughs> what the rebels like to forget is that the Empire is what's keeping the Dominion out of Skyrim. Okay, I'm kind of, I'm kind of curious. Let's figure this. Let's talk to him a bit. Just head north. You can't miss it. It's the capital of Whiterun Hold, the biggest and the best of the nine holds of Skyrim. But don't take my word for it. Of course. I know today wasn't the best introduction to the Legion, but I hope you'll give us another chance. The Legion could really use someone like you, especially now. And if the rebels have themselves a dragon, General Tullius is the only one who can stop them. Okay. Knows where the general order mics. Okay. Um. You know, let's do the first one. No, not yet. After all, a dragon, something out of old tales and legends. No one could have expected that. But you can bet he'll be trying to figure it out. This could shift the whole balance of the war. If you want to help stop that dragon, your best bet is to go to Solitude and join up with the Legion. Sure, I understand. It's not easy to go from being executed by the Legion one day to joining up the next. But I think you'll see that the Legion is Skyrim's only hope for real peace right now. I know you'll make the right choice in the end. Okay. Well, I have a few other questions. Keep Edward. an eye out for trouble. It's only a matter of time. Well, you didn't know? That was Ulfric Stormcloak and his top lieutenants. Uh, he's a traitor. Okay. Right. The leader of the Stormcloaks. They claim to be fighting for Skyrim's freedom. But the war is really all about Ulfric wanting to be High King of Skyrim. A masterstroke by General Tullius. He's only been in charge here for a few months, but he's turned things around for the Empire. We've been trying to catch Ulfric since the war started, but he always seemed to slip through our fingers, like he knew we were coming. This time, the General turned the tables on him. Ulfric rode right into our ambush with only a few bodyguards. He surrendered pretty meekly too. So much for his death or glory reputation. I thought we were taking Ulfric back to Cyrodiil, but I guess the general changed his mind. You know the rest. General Tullius has his headquarters in Castle Dower, in the city of Solitude, northwest of here. You'll want to talk to Legate Ricca. She deals with the new recruits. I'll be sure to put in a good word for you if I get back to Solitude first. You haven't heard of the civil war in Skyrim? I guess down in Cyrodiil, people have other things to worry about. It's pretty simple. Ulfric founded the Stormcloaks years ago, as a sort of private army to advance his ambitions. He's always used the ban on the warship of Talos to stir people up against the Empire. He never succeeded in getting much support. So a few months ago, he murdered the High King. That got the Empire's attention. So did I. If the damn Stormcloak somehow found one, or woke it up, the war might be about to take an ugly turn. Hard to believe it was just a coincidence that the first dragon anyone seen for centuries attacks just as Ulfric was about to be executed. I guess that wasn't such a big deal elsewhere in the Empire, but here it's caused a lot of resentment, native sun and all that. Even I'll admit it hasn't been the Empire's finest hour. But it wasn't like the Emperor had any choice, did he? If he hadn't signed the peace treaty with the Thalmor, they would have destroyed the Empire. Then where would Skyrim be? That's the part that Ulfric's supporters always conveniently forget about. Unless the Empire stands together, the Thalmor will destroy us all. Be careful on the way to Solitude. Damn really Stormcloaks could be anywhere. Alright, let's go ahead and talk to her real Make quick. Make yourself at home. Just follow the road north. When you get to Hunting Brew Meadery, turn left and the road will take you to the city gates. It's not far. 
We used to go to the market there every month or so until the roads got so dangerous with the war and all. Okay. I just hope the war doesn't come to Riverwood. There's enough trouble in the world without those storm cloaks stirring up more. All true, right then. True. Take that. Oh, I can't get the armor. Oh, they were okay with everything else, but as soon as I brought up the iron, the iron armor, they're like, "Bro, you're going too far. You can't take that. You can take everything else, just not the armor. The armor is mine." Like Jesus Christ. I just want the armor. I want the armor. All right. Well, that don't work out. Hey, at least we got that all settled away. So let's go ahead. Let's explore the town a bit. Like I mean, I don't gotta rush. I mean, let's take a look. So we got grindstone, grind okay, steel, other shit. Ooh. Hello. I'll wear some iron boots. All right, all right, all right, uh, not, not bad. Let's go ahead, we'll go to the grindstone real quick, because uh, that's a good thing for me to do. We'll go ahead, let's upgrade my, let's upgrade this uh, steel war axe. Then we'll upgrade my armor. At least the stuff that matters, not gonna worry much on the leather aspect of it. Wait, hold on. Hold on. Why do, why am I wearing the iron the iron ones when I have steel right there? Am I that fucking stupid? Okay, cool. Um I think the best thing to do, I'm gonna wait 14 hours. So it's day because I want the markets to be open. If the market's not open I can't clear out my inventory. Uh which is the big thing I'm worried about is my inventory is still like fairly uh full so All right time to go in here and uh make a little bit of a trade well, as i as i put it something oh i said no no adventures no theatrics no thief chasing well what are you going to do then huh let's hear it we are done talking about this oh <clears throat> a customer <laughs> sorry you had to hear that well, I don't know what you overheard, but the Riverwood Trader is still open. Feel free to shop. Uh, yeah, we, we did have a bit of a, a break-in. We, we still have plenty to sell. Robbers were only after one thing. An ornament. Solid gold in the shape of a dragon's claw. You could? I've got some coin coming in from my last shipment. It's yours if you bring my claw back. Now, if you're going to okay. get those thieves, you should head to Bleak Falls Barrow, so northeast of town. Again? Yes. So now you don't have to go, do you? Oh, really? Well, I think your new helper here needs a guide. Uh, no, I... By the eight, fine. But only to the edge of town. Okay, well, before I do that... Show those thieves not to steal from Luke and Valerius. I think I have a few old spell books laying about. If you want more, you'll have to go to the College of Winterhold. Okay. Um, so let's go ahead. We'll just go ahead and start selling. Why well, I don't need... Oh, man, those Creation Club rewards look cool. So I don't need that. Don't need that. We'll sell both uh, bows. I'm going to sell the steel sword because I don't think I need it anytime soon. Re up. Boom. 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 I'm going to keep these because I feel like I didn't do something with those. Alright. Food. Not going to sell anything there. Need to read that book. Boom, boom. Alright. Not too bad so far. What type of books does he have? He has clairvoyance. Already got that. Uh, we'll buy Frostbite, Fur, Fury, Lesser Ward. 
Oak Flesh, and Ray's Dead. There we go. That was all my coin, but at least I got some pretty good items so far. Um, books, we can go ahead, we'll read all these, so I have all these magic, Eat magic, because that makes sense. Now we'll go ahead, uh, we I think we'll, oh. On and across the bridge. Okay, we're gonna go ahead, let's mark the Golden Claw as our mission. So. I need to unmark that. You can see it from here, though. The mountain just over the buildings. Okay. Those thieves must be mad hiding out there. Those old crypts are filled with nothing but traps, trolls, and who knows what else. And you want to go up there. Who's the real mad one here? I wonder why they only stole Lucan's golden claw. I mean, we have plenty of things in the shop that are worth just as much coin. Lucan found the claw about a year after he opened the store. He never quite explained where he got it. He's a tricky one. Okay. This way. Yeah, I'm waiting for you to go forward, ma'am. Okay, whatever. I'll go on without you. I'm assuming you don't want to follow. Okay, I was gonna say, come on. You're the guide. Yeah, she don't want to follow me no more. That's fine. You stay in the town. Oh, wait, are you running to tell me goodbye or what? I don't think she was expecting me to go any further. All right, let's see what we got. This is the bridge out of town. The path up the mountain to the northwest leads to Bleak Falls Barrow. I guess I should get back to my brother. He'll throw a fit if I take too long. <laughs> Such a child. All right, well, have a good one. I'm gonna go uh, get me a claw. Because uh, that's the smart thing for me to do. Alright, let's hope for the best here because who knows what I'll experience up here. Shit. Where, where are they? Oh, they're not marked. Hello. Yeah, sorry. We're not doing that. Not today. I mean, I'll take the wolf pelt, though. That, what the? Oh, that was a bird. I was like, what's that shadow popping up? Like, it, it looked like a wolf when I first saw it. I was like, did, did one of the wolves go flying? Is that what I'm going on? Is that what I'm dealing with now? Flying, flying uh, wolves? Would be a shocker with me. I mean, this is a Bethesda game, so I should expect a lot of glitches. Uh, so, yeah. <laughs> Thumbs up there. I mean, I'm trying to remember. In Fall, I think in the uh, Fallout games, I, I dealt with a lot of glitches too. Ah uh, man, that, that reminds me. I need to do uh, the rest of Fallout New Vegas, the DLC. I really do need to finish that. that I think that might actually be pretty chill, dude. Is anyone? Okay. Either my armor is just heavy, and they, they notice me based off that, or what? Nope. Okay, there, okay. Hey, buddy, don't mind me. Just gonna go ahead and keep going forward. Can I just fuck it. I don't, I don't care. Oh, you look more terrifying than everyone else. Okay, there's one down. I will take that shield, we'll equip the iron armor, and there we go. Now I look more like a proper badass. Alright, here we go. It's nothing. You know, I was fine with this, but you, you, had, you had to be a problem. Alright, here we go. Time to ex 
explore this area where they were all guarding. For some odd reason. We got a coin purse. Always a plus. And now that I think about it, let's go to apparel. So we got the branded shield and we got the fine. Obviously we want the branded. Because it has just one more defense than the other, so. Point, always a plus. Alright guys, well you know what, I'm going to go ahead and we're going to end it here. If you guys enjoy, make sure to like, subscribe, check out the links in the description below, it really helps out, and I'll see you guys next time. Bye!